If all goes according to plan, by Thursday, America will be one small step closer to sending humans to Mars. That's when NASA is scheduled to launch the first test flight of its Orion capsule. This week's mission will be unmanned, but Orion is designed to carry astronauts the more than 30 million miles it will take to reach the red planet. Orion's first journey will be shorter than that. Two orbits around the Earth, reaching an altitude of 3,600 miles. Still, that's more than 15 times higher than the International Space Station and farther than any spacecraft built for humans has gone since the Apollo moon missions nearly 40 years ago. Four hours and 24 minutes later, Orion will return to Earth, reaching speeds of up to 20,000 miles per hour. At that velocity, Orion's exterior will reach temperatures near 4,000 degrees Fahrenheit, which is why NASA has equipped the spacecraft with the largest heat shield ever made. After splashing down in the Pacific Ocean, Orion's next launch isn't scheduled for another three years. Astronauts won't step inside it for another seven, and an actual mission to Mars is at least 20 years away. As a spacecraft, Orion is incredibly fast. As a program, it's a bit slower.